The Duke and Duchess of Sussex attended the One Young World Summit in the UK's second largest city on Monday evening. Following the couple's brief visit, Britons on the streets of Manchester shared their thoughts with Express.co.uk. Michelle, a nurse from Didsbury, said she doesn't really care what Harry and Meghan have to say. She believes the couple could be using their platform to help with other more pressing issues plaguing the country. There's more important things happening at the minute like the cost of living crisis. Maybe they could use their platforms to help with that, she added. The event gained some criticism as the young leaders were made to fork out for the tickets and travel to the event, with tickets reportedly costing more than £1,000 per day to attend. Ben Goldsborough, a trainee solicitor from Chalton, said the ticket price is extortionate and excludes people from disadvantaged backgrounds. He added, as soon as you attach a price, especially one that expensive, then it does make it more based on your background and how privileged you are. I understand these things do cost money but I think that's quite extortionate. But not all those asked felt the same way, as Eva Black, a 31-year-old architect from Ancoats, said the price of the ticket, though quite expensive is good if it's going towards charity. However, she added that there will not be opinions and ideas from across the board if you exclude people that can't afford to pay that price. A total of 30% of young people are believed to have attended the summit on a scholarship. During her speech, Meghan told the crowd it was very nice to be back in the UK and told the delegates they are the future and present, and the people driving positive and necessary change needed across the globe. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex received a positive reception and huge cheers from the crowd of 2,000 people. But they also faced limited booing by protesters as they exited the car outside the venue, with one protester reportedly holding a sign which said, Fake Royals, in capital letters. <laughs>